Hi guys, welcome to another video review. Again, sorry, this is a video collection overview. I was going to do some figures, I was getting late. I ended up doing lots of painting on a Megzord figure, which I'll probably show off in the next few weeks when I've got some stickers from Repro Labels. So until I've actually cleaned myself up, and it sounds quite clean, but the rest isn't. I thought, do a DVD overview collection, and hopefully next week going to some figures or my new Megazord kind of overview, but have a look. Now here we have some classic Christmas films. If I turn this off, you probably... No, I'm still going to show it. I was showing these recently in a pickup video update. This is a very nice still book. Then a new film. Then all of the James Bond films. There's also the Daniel Craig on Blu-ray. Then all the Mission Impossibles. Austin Powers. Then to my Jim Carrey collection I have. On to my girly but still really good fun films. Even though they are they are a little bit girly, but they're still quite fun. Saw this a few years ago. Really funny, good film to watch. Yes, it is a girl's film, but still really funny. Really enjoy that. The heat. It just like it's got a massive dent in it. Don't know how I got that, but still quite funny. Stand by me. I've seen a long time ago. Brilliant film. Breakfast Club. I've never seen. I still haven't seen it, but good. Bad Boy, very good. Kimpin is a very funny film. Everyone should at least watch it once. Very funny. It's a classic. Now that is them. Now back onto the shelves. And we've got my Jack Black. Very funny films. Really enjoy Be Kind Rewind. Saw that cinema. Brilliant film. Then this guy, I can remember his name, but. This film, yes, it sounds a bit rude. It can be a bit rude and crude, but very funny. Definitely worth watching. Same with Hot Top Time Machine, one of those weird films. Internship, it's all that. Really funny, definitely worth picking up. Same with Role Models. Goon, don't know what I was expecting that. Sean William Scott, I don't know what I was expecting from that, but turned out really, really good film. Get in there. I think he's one of those actors, he's either really good or he's crap. Anchorman, finally seen. Definitely worth a watch, very funny. Ted. I think I picked this up cheaper. I picked it up on Blu-ray. And I picked it up on Steelbook. Blu-ray. And it was cheaper, because it was on sale, than the, the actual bloody Blu-ray. Back in there. There's one of those weird ones you pick up and it's really cheap, so I don't know why. But on and again. Right, this is an 18. DVD is a 15. I don't know why it's so bad that I had up to an 18 for the Blu ray. But oh well. There's a camera trying to focus badly, it's struggling today. With the Millers, I saw this. I watched this with my mum. I didn't think she'd enjoy it, but it's really funny. And some Scott Pilgrim, we'll get this on Steel Rope, got two. I've actually picked this film up about four times. Really enjoy it. Got to read the comic books at some point, but really good film. Classic Police Academy. Eventually, we'll pick these up on Blu ray, but brilliant films. Except for. The last three, they were crap. Hot Shots Part 1 and 2 up. Really funny. Ali G. Now I remember this was on the TV. Everyone knows him as Borat, Bruno. I've never seen Borat or The Dictator, but I have just picked him up on Blu-ray. So I will be watching them very soon. And 
Never ending story. Love this film as a kid. Labyrinth of Dark Crystal, I've never seen. But Darren Isaac, I think that's better say his name right. He said these are fantastic films, so I thought I'd give them a go. And you got The Mummy. I've never watched The Scorpion King. I may get it at some point. On this side, you got Twilight and Hung Games. Never watched, but I might do at some point. Sources Apprenticeship. Brilliant film. Everyone says Pant. Brilliant film. I really enjoyed it. And Kevin and Perry. It's very English. I always, I always hope people say it's a very English film, but it is. It's very funny, though. If you're from, grew up watching Harry Enfield, you'll find it brilliant. Uh, American Pie. Love these series. I mean, these I call uh, originals. Not watch any others. I don't want to because they're the classics. Never seen this film when I was really young. Absolutely loving it. Very funny. Same with Road Trip and Euro Trip. And to films that have been recommended to me. This one just looks freaking weird. And pretty much why I picked it up. Fight Club, Blu ray, and DVD. Again, nice still book. Fantastic film. Really weird, but fantastic. Real still. Hugh Jackman's fantastic in this. Demolition Man, Last Action Hero. Last Action Hero. I don't think. I don't know why. That picture looks like the one from when he's a spy. Not that. So I, I always think that looks a bit weird, personally. That's not going to go back in, so I've got to jump in bed. Terminator again. Nice steel book. If you don't notice, I do like my steel books. Not a very nice big Indiana Jones box set. Love that. Sherlock Holmes. Dark Man is one of those films. It is very weird. But I am a big fan of it. So I I originally saw the second and third one. Never saw the first one. Finally picked this up. Liam Nielsen is fantastic in it. Definitely worth getting. Very dark, but still really good. The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. This is a nice two disc set. This is when DVDs had a one disc or two disc nice box set. Can pick up the two set. Same with Van Helsing. Nice collector's edition. I am, um, if you're going to get it, get in the collector's edition, slip cover, metal edition. I'll always get the special edition version. And The Crow. Fantastic film. Absolutely, if you've never seen it. I haven't seen these ones, so I won't say that, well, well I've heard their pants, but if you're going to watch it, watch the original, because it's so fantastic. Highlander. Again, a film from, I remember from my childhood. Absolutely love it. What the oh that's a fantastic movie. I've got a pink blur around my camera, I don't know what that is, but that's pretty weird. But no, Highlander is fantastic. Highlander two, not so good. So that's the I used to have a shelf there, but as you can tell the walls were kind of shit. It fell down, so that's why they were on my bed. So thank you for watching, stay tuned, we'll be doing a, hopefully, a bigger review next week, but thank you for watching, and bye for now.